that's great. Goodbye anonymity. We were having lunch over at NBC. We were using the Chico and the Man set. And we're there with Jerry Renau, who I've written with also. And uh, we're there having lunch. It was me and Ron and, and uh, Larry and John. And it was the night that the show was going to premiere. So we were like four or five episodes ahead of ourselves. And we aren't thinking much about it because our experience, well, Larry was the movie star. Okay, not John at the time. Larry had done Claudine. He had done Cooley High. He was a movie star. You, you walked down the street with Larry, and, and kids knew who he was. And Jerry said, guys, after tonight, say goodbye to your anonymity. And I said, what does that mean? <laughs> he said, forget it. Life is never going to be the same for you as it is today. You're not going to be able to walk down the street. Your personal life is going to go. Everyone's going to think you are who you are on camera. And he was right. It was shocking. Because the next day I went to the market and people were saying, hey Epstein, hey Epstein. And I'm looking around, oh, me? Yeah, he was right, even to this day. I think I got full of myself. You know, ego inflates. I was just in my early 20s. <laughs> and uh, I call it access to excess, that time in my life. Access to excess. I was like a kid in a candy shop who just, you know, I wound up getting all cavities. Wouldn't you know it? <laughs> Wouldn't you know it? Of course, access to excess. Uh, there were a lot of... We did a thing at Jacob Javits Center, the four of us, and it was really the last appearance we ever made together outside of the studio. And it was uh, some kind of car show, something like that. And we had never been out before. It was, if we were, if the show started airing in September, we went out like in October. And really, it was like going to the soundstage, going home. Going to the soundstage, going home. We had never been out in mass before. And we walked on the stage at Jacob Javits Center, and there was about 25,000 screaming kids there. We barely got off the stage. There was no security. We, I had sh my shirt ripped off, my one shoe. I had these great Italian loafers. One shoe came off. Hair was being pulled. It was insanity. We never got to do the autographs. We never got to do anything other than run for our lives. And we said, that's it. No more going out together.